Oh boy, Bifrost in OMP2, I think. What the heck could this possibly be? Hmm. That is quite the hairstyle. <laughs> oh! oh boy, that's right, fellas. I'm playing Econoclasts. Look at that cast of characters. I bet at least two of them are playable. Anyways, that's my complaint about the game. <laughs> um, I wanted to talk about some funny stuff that happened recently, but I'm not sure about how important the lore and story is in this game, because I don't remember. Um, I played this once before. Not enough that I remember it too exactly, but enough that I can beat the game. Probably. But, I mean, I beat the game the first time without knowing the lore and story either, so, you know. Enough, really, only that I know that, uh, the, uh, sizable looking cast of characters on the, the title screen is deceptive. <laughs> uh, but that's all I'll say about that for now. Uh-huh. Hey, look. That looks like a character. Oh boy, is she playable? She is! Nice! Not that I can double jump or anything. Hum, hum, hum. But, uh huh. This is. Oh, jeez. Jump and shoot and stuff. That's right, I have a gun. Heck yeah. Holy. <laughs> nice. Did I. Oh, jeez. Look at that. A full 99%. <laughs> Since when do I have more than one save file? Oh, you know what? It, it was, um... Never mind. I remember exactly why. I like how there are save files denoting different characters, but only... Anyways, let's just go with five for now. You're gonna hear me complain about that more than once. Just don't even worry about it. So... Um, I wonder if that is important. So, I was, um, I had a, 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 a lady friend over the other day, and, I don't know, it's, it's hardly deceptive. I, I would say it's kind of deceptive to call her lady friend, because it's not like, well, I guess it was a date. It was a date, but it's not like we're already going out. It was a first date and a deal, so we, you know, I was at my house, and we were... Watching Star Wars The Clone Wars, the animated series, you know, as as one does. My gun over. Darn. I just hate when that happens. Poggers. So, uh, but my dad actually has one of those, um, he has one of those fancy Nancy uh, ring doorbells, right? So, it's got a camera on and everything. So, at some point, he was like, uh, called me up. He was like, who's the young lady? You know? And, I mean, I explained the whole, oh, you know, no, just a friend I have, you know? Um. What the heck? Oh, hey! A chest with a key! Nice. More improvium. I am not going to the left. This is a simple exploration game, which I don't have to do. Aha! Uh -huh. I can crawl. Nice. But, uh, the real funny part is this morning, um, I woke up and I was taking out the recycling, because the recycling bin was kind of full. And as I was doing that, I'm like, literally right out the door, and I go, um, friggin', Oh, who's the young lady? Your mom! And I look over and I see the ring doorbell, I'm like, this thing has a a microphone does it, doesn't it? Lo and behold, my dad calls me up. He's like, "Hey, how you doing?" I'm like, "Yeah, I'm doing well." And he goes, "Yeah, the uh, the doorbell does have a microphone." <laughs> oh, jeez. What was this a mistake or something? How was I supposed to know that that house would have no floor? Sheesh. Oh. Um. Uh, eesh. 
Living floor. Oh, jeez, that'll explain that. Why? Oh, boy. Boss battle right off the boss bat. Sheesh. Oh, well, that doesn't seem too terrible. I am great at button mashing, so... The ancient art. And I can do things like this. Okay, never mind. That was a bad idea. I overheated my gun and I didn't even do damage. I'll stick to mashing. Or not. This does seem like it's kind of a good idea. At least right there. I mean, look at that damage. Wow. Oh boy, this my computer doesn't like this game, apparently. Yeah, I'll do that when he's in the middle, I guess. He, I don't know what this thing is, but let's say it's a he. Or just when I have time. Oh boy. Oh, great damage. No. I'm just gonna do this hitless. Oh well. Ye okay, sheesh, sheesh. Why are you in the center now? Oh, well. That'll do it, I guess. The heck was that thing? Weird eyeball creature. Yeah, back to my normal life! <laughs> Sheesh, fellas. This kind of game, eh? Yeah, I already knew that. And I can shoot while I'm crouching, but not while crawling, because that's too many things going on at once. You can expect me to shoot while crouching, and you can expect me to crawl while crouching. But you cannot expect me to crawl while shooting. That's too much. So I guess that's everything in this area. Oh, I do have a map, actually. I was about to be like, you know, not that I have a map or anything. Uh, you know, it's almost worth checking out. Oh, it's, it's kind of worth checking out. Just a little bit. What? It's not like there's other areas to look at. But yes, this is what I have decided to replace Celeste with. No, I... I guess so. Because I don't like playing Celeste. But I'll play Iconoclasts. Is this... Like a... Am I still gonna fall down through here? Yes, I am. Of course. That makes sense. It's not like there was a cave-in at the top or anything, that the area filled with rocks. I gain nothing from killing enemies, by the way. I don't think. But, yes. Yes! I've decided to replace another series with a series I never put on the series pending playlist. That's right. Not that I care, my only gripe with this game is that it has a deceptive number of playable characters, as I have said before. Yes, we did it, guys. Oh, well. That doesn't seem good. Uh, who is at my house and why? <laughs> oh, yay, she's here. I'm Agent Black, and this is my partner, Agent White. Bro, we're getting a full-on visit from the agents from Johnny Test. <laughs> oh, boy. Daughter of Polro, mechanic for the concern, who died two months ago, leaving his daughter alone. Well, that's your backstory out of the way. Time to get a job, right? You won job lottery. You are now... Uh... Oh? The most horrid of accusations. What? <laughs> We've heard things. My head. Reports on Polo's death, Ted. He was killed by some unfortunate accident. Well, that's it's gonna be replaced. Well, what could his possess pass down to his little darling? What could she do with it? Fixing mechanical problems with the poor people in the village like a heroine of handiwork. Hmm. Yeesh. Might you not say you could be a part of the reason? What? <laughs> Some real good cop cat, bad cop stuff. Private practice is a sin. Private mechanic, for worse. Oh boy. A, a 
techno theocracy. Interesting. If we all just choose our profession, nothing in this world would ever get done. A communistic techno theocracy at that. Who wants balance, my dear. Couldn't find any tools around the house, though, and you only seem to be carrying that tiny excuse for a stun gun. I'm sure not in the mood for hunting Tontaran, so. Uh, somebody's. Harlot! <laughs> White, shut up. Um. Something bigger's come up. Well, that's nice. These fun government agents are now leaving my home that they so nicely invaded. <sighs> she still has a date with fate. Yeah, get the heck out of here, White. Shut up. Sheesh. Yeah. I think I kept my wrench down here. My massive golden wrench that I used to beat people with. That's right, I can do the freaking hi ya ya from Brawl Pit. The Brawl Pit hi ya ya I'm gonna only ever refer to it as that. And there's a whole bunch of crap I can do with it too. Um, but for now, I'll leave it there. Till next time. Like, comment, and subscribe, or I will smack you in the head with a massive wrench, and it'll really hurt. It'll hurt so bad to get smacked in the head with a massive wrench, trust me. Till then, though, goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.